Hey everybody, welcome back to the farm. Today, I'm gonna bring you along and show you how we winterize the gas pump on our sprayer. All right, here's the pump that we use on our sprayer. We've got it all set up with valves. And the first thing we're gonna do is open this valve. No, first thing we need to do is cut the valve off under the sprayer. That way if anything's in the line, then open this valve. Open this one, it'll give it air. Now we'll let the pump drain into the bucket. We can actually open this one also. We've got it set up so you can actually spray with this outfit and the same pump I'll pull it out of the nurse tank for you. All right. That's that part. And we mainly spray nitrogen. There's your filter. You can screw your filter off when you're draining your pump and it'll drain that line. But we never have any trouble with liquid nitrogen freezing. But if we've sprayed a chemical mix with water, then you know you want to definitely make sure that everything's out of it. Next thing we're going to do is close the lines off. This valve still open. This is just burnt motor oil where we've changed the oil in something. Just pour you about a half a quart in there. Uh oh too fast and this will stop the liquid nitrogen from corroding your pumps up we've tried several roller pumps and stuff that runs off the PTO but we've had a lot of trouble and had to replace them a lot since we've been putting oil in it and starting them up and letting them run for a minute or two. We've had very good luck with it. Just pour you about a half a quart of oil. And this valve on the top also comes in good if you're trying to prime your pump. It should be close to a half a quart. What we do now is we close the valve so it don't throw none out. This valve is closed so it don't try to return it into the tank. you run it for a few minutes like that once a month or so if I happen to be coming by and I think about it I'll start it up that way it just keeps the oil slung all over the inside the pump then in the spring when I need it I'll do the same process I just showed you to drain it I'll put a little bit of cleaner in there drain it out and she's good to go well, we have several people ask us how do we winterize our sprayer so i figured i would share the process with you i appreciate y'all watching if you like what we're doing give us a thumbs up subscribe ring the bell where you don't miss any of our upcoming videos we'll see you on the next one